Nara today and I'm wearing the hat I bought yesterday. I wasn't expecting to wear it until winter, but it's super windy today. But, 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 I'm not raining. Typhoon has passed. Though you can kind of see the aftermath here. I think I can visit most of Nara's attractions in one day. And um, Nara is famous for its park which are uh, crowded, can you say crowded with? Crowded with deer, home to a lot of deer. And you can buy deer food and feed the deer. So I'm gonna do a little walk around the park. And yeah, you can already see some people selling deer. Super happy with the weather. I'm a little cold, I'm going to lie. I was very happy. Out and about again. Oh my god, I can see deer already. I see deer. Deer. Oh my god. Deer. 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 Okay. It begins. <laughs> I'm gonna go find some deer food and uh, say hi what to some. What color is it? Oh, that's a I'm gonna find my own deer. Hello, buddy. Hello. something pretty dangerous probably and I'm gonna lift my put my camera down for a minute and call the deer to me a little deserted spot here so let's do this are just as vicious, well not vicious, but as <laughs> spoiled as they said. Look, they ate my, <laughs> ate my map. Ugh. Stupid deer. <laughs> Stupid deer. But I, did, I refused to give him more uh, deer senbei. He stole my map or she, I don't know. And just, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm not sure what If you don't feed them, they'll tug at your clothes. I don't know. I've got deer slime all over me. me. I don't like that they cut the horns off, but I guess it's necessary with the amount of tourists here. He looks a little sad without his horns. Uh, not his horns, you know, his antlers. Jeez. <laughs> my camera to my bag so this is why I'm filming like this I want to go to Isuyan Garden which is this way it's really cold today I'm so happy I have my hat it's not that maybe it's not that cold but it's certainly windy I guess at least 
typhoon and we're completely over. Like I said, at least it's not raining. I've had a few rays of, sun rays of sunshine, which has been wonders to my morale. So, <laughs> I'm wondering if I should go around or go through here. Did it! It was fine. <laughs> which is uh, probably the main attraction here at Nara after the deer of course after the deer no. uh, because it's uh, home to uh, I think the, the biggest Buddha or one of the biggest Buddhas in Japan or in the world I'm sorry I need to brush up on my history should be around here somewhere uh, a lot of people over there so I'm guessing it's over there uh, the gardens were cool, really pricey though. I mean, it's like supposedly for the garden and the museum. The museum is tiny, you can go around it in like five minutes. It's more like an exhibition for seals. Not like our, our seals, like stamp seals. <laughs> uh, but the, the garden was really, really pretty. Gorgeous garden, Japanese style, traditional, uh, well taken care of, everything you need just extremely pricey in my opinion. Okay, onto the temple and there will probably be an admittance fee anyway, so geez, these temples are ruining me as much as street food. <laughs> oh well, totally worth it, I mean. It's not like I'm in Japan every day. <laughs> and also I'm doing everything like at the same time, like whole bunch of visit concentrated in one like short month so of course everything seems expensive every time I need to fish out like between 300 to 10,000 yen for a visit. I mean the garden was 900 yen which is probably the most expensive so far. There are more deer here! 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 Okay let me see where I need to go. Coming up to some crossroads again. Behind me over there is the south gate. Uh, you can see it. Right there. And that's the Daiji. Let me show you now. And the deer.
what this means exactly, but I know that if you can make your way through the pillar, it's good. So it's something good. <laughs> that you need a good few weeks of intense rain and horrible weather to really appreciate the sun like this. Just had a bit of deer cracker. Not bad. <laughs> I'm sure I could eat it if I was starving. Good girl. He's a good girl. I'm climbing over there. Yep. Getting kind of hungry. Mm. So the place I went to, the first place I went to have lunch in, which had bagels and tofu, they were sold out of bagels. So I found this other little place. They had like soups and stuff, but. I feel like I've been having a lot of soups and I wanted to try something different, so I went for dessert. I went for something called Warabi Mochi, which, damn it. I asked for the name in, in, uh, in Japanese and then I forgot to. Um, let me just show you what I had. It was here. I had this. There we go. And the guy said it was. Yeah, now I can actually read it. Warabi Mochi. Bracken root starch, and I think the powder is called kinako powder, but I'm not sure. I saw it on other people's vlogs, and honestly, it's super subtle, but it's fresh. It tastes cold and fresh, and the powder gives it really cool texture. So it was a lunch, but it was good, and I want to have been wanting to try that for a while, and yeah, I actually really enjoyed that. So would recommend. So now I'm on the way to... Jeez, I forgot the name. Uh, it starts with a K. <laughs> That's all I can tell you. Maybe it's written over here. Kasugasaisha. <laughs> over down here. And I'm guessing this is where I am. Ooh, there we go. And so far I am bloody. I want to show you the bridge behind me. So far, I'm loving Nara so much. I'm not sure I would appreciate it as much if it were raining the way it rained in um, in Kyoto when I visited visited it. <laughs> but uh, it's beautifulish weather. Like I said, a little cold. Happy to have my hat. And Nara is basically a big park slash forest with beautiful trees beautiful scenery like unbelievable beautiful shrines wonderful fresh air i just so far i love nara and the deers the friggin deers so yeah i'm not sure which way i have to go 
the seaside came from that way and there's only that way to go. That's where I'm going. Yep, yep, yep. Hello. Hello. Hello, bowing deer. <laughs> You're a little scary looking. <laughs> yeah. I got that one so far. Kamu. Kamu is bite, I guess. Tataku. Oh, I can't read that one. <laughs> when it's a kanji, I can't read it. So you guys can be little bastards sometime, huh? You guys can be little bastards? Baby, yucky, yucky, yeah, yucky. Let it go. Yucky, yucky. I haven't traveled to many places in my life, but I can say, in all the, in all honesty, without exaggeration, that Nara is one of the most beautiful places I've ever been. It's just absolutely beautiful. You can just hear the stream when you walk in the woods. You've got this fresh mountain air. And every now and then you have a, a Tory gate and then you continue your way. And there are the stone lanterns every now and then. It's just absolutely beautiful. I've already wasted an entire battery filming this, but I know I won't like bring it justice. I won't do it justice, that's the worst I'm looking for. I know I won't do it justice. Because <laughs> this is just too beautiful. I'm gonna try and save that, that poor old last battery because I'm not done yet. And uh, yeah. Whoa, just wow, guys. I have no words. I'm so happy I waited an extra day to come see this. I'm gonna. Ooh, oh my god. I'm gonna give the day the last of my crackers because I think I'm done with my little toy here. <laughs> Those freaking deers! I gave them all my crackers and one of them bit my butt. <laughs> I don't even think I got that on camera. Oh. I mean, you, in, you wait for one of them to show up and they're like, oh, I'm so shy. I don't dare come all by myself. And then they swarm you and you give them everything you got. And then you say like, okay, I'm done. You show your hands and they're like, okay, there's nothing left. You turn around to pack your bag and one of them bites you in the fucking butt. <laughs> Yeah.